Pink News exclusive transgender campaigner Lily Madigan has not been selected for the Joe Cox Women in Leadership program. The teen activist faced national criticism when she applied for the role, particularly from the Times newspaper. The paper quoted anti-trans labor members attacking Madigan for applying to the leadership program founded after the murder of labor MP Joe Cox last year. Pink News understands her application has been rejected, though organizers behind the program strongly supported her right to apply. She told Pink News whilst I was disappointed, I wasn't surprised. I've only been a member of Labour since June and so hadn't had much time to build up experience prior to applying in November. I'm proud of what I've achieved in such a small frame of time, especially since applying but I understand why I still fall short of the standard of such a distinguished program. Fortunately, I have plenty to keep me busy this year including roles locally and a politics degree, as well as other political programs and speaking engagements. I have a lot to offer the Labour Party as well as the trade union movement and you can count on my continuing to stand up for disadvantaged members. She also vowed to apply for the program again at the end of 2018. When she first revealed applying for the course, the Times quoted a Labour member who called it a monstrous insult to women. Another Momentum member was quoted by the paper saying women in the party are fuming that Madigan has applied for a place on the program. However, 55 labor activists involved in the Joe Cox Women in Leadership scheme wrote to defend Ms. Madigan in response. The Times declined to publish the letter in spite of extensive coverage criticizing the student. The abuse became so great at one stage that she begged transphobes and sections of the press to end their abuse. The 19-year-old wrote on Twitter last year, Please stop. I can't handle it anymore. I'm so mentally distressed that I can't sleep or eat or go to school. No one deserves this. There's only so many times I can read lies or my dead name or misgendering. I'm just a teenager. Please just stop. I don't want to do this anymore. Please stop. I can't handle it anymore. I'm so mentally distressed that I can't sleep or eat or go to school. No one deserves this. There's only so many times I can read lies or my dead name or misgendering. I'm just a teenager. Please just stop. I don't want to do this anymore. Lily Madigan Rose at Madigan underscore Lily December 5, 2017 Despite the abuse, the teen told Pink News in an interview late last year that she won't let transphobes stop her from pursuing her political passions. The Labour Party is not only a safe place for transgender people but actively supports them with programs like the Joe Cox Women in Leadership program asking for underrepresented and self-identifying women. We also have our leader Jeremy Corbyn calling for changes to the GRA to help trans people, and I've had the opportunity to ask him about transphobia in society and media and he gave a very supportive answer. Despite the high-profile attacks, Lily says transphobes cannot stop her. I'd love to be the first trans MP, she said. It's about time.